I'm Eva Palacios, and I'm here to empower you. What's up, guys? Eva Palacios here with another Financial Freedom Friday. Today's topic, we're going to talk about raising money smart kids. How many of you already have money smart kids? I know I never grew up in a household even talking about money, and most of Americans don't. So think about it. Growing up in a household where money was never a topic of discussion, how did we even learn about effective money management skills? I was blessed to get hired on in a very early age to learn about finances, stuck with that job for 17 years, and that's how I learned about money but most people don't have that type of experience. So if you don't have the experience, chances are your children may not have that experience either. So there's a couple of ways that you could change the generations to come. It could be having your children tune into these types of videos. It could be pouring onto them with audiobooks, maybe some podcasts, but most importantly, I like to be a product of the product. I like to learn myself so that I in turn can teach it to my children. So definitely money can be a very hot topic, but sometimes it could be a very ugly topic if we come from a household that was never ever talked about those types of things. So in terms of my own situation, I have been able to teach my kids things like Always make sure you know how much your income is. I've got a 19 year old, he's already working. Guess what mom's doing? Checking in every payday. How's your paycheck look? He even tells me, mom, jobs are for the birds. I don't know if I could even deal with these little paychecks, which then can spiral into doing things like entrepreneurship or learning a certain trade that can literally open their eyes to bigger and better things in life but it can be as simple as teaching your two-year-old or three-year-old to put money in a piggy bank, start saving early, developing those types of habits to where they're getting money from, I don't know, maybe grandparents or their cousins for birthdays, teaching them how to put money away to save, to be able to then buy the things that they desire to have. I'm gonna be honest. I don't buy my kids things like video games or high ticketed shoes or clothing. I give them the bare essentials. We're talking food on the table, roof over your head, lights on type situations. Every single luxury they've got, they've actually paid for it with their own money. Whether it's birthday money, holiday money, graduation money. And in my own personal opinion, when these children slash young adults pay for things with their own money, guess what? Don't they take better care of their stuff? I know my kids do. So little things like that can go a long way, teaching them early on effective money management habits so that when they grow up to young adults, they can fly the nest and you will be a very happier parent because they're not relying on you for everything. So I hope you like what you heard. If so, click below, subscribe, add some comments, and I look forward to teaching your kids some effective money management skills.